Welcome back to Devil May Cry 4 Special Edition Virgil Mode. Edition. S Son of Sparta. Hey, Mark. Yeah? But before we get started. Yeah, um. The, the ornament. Oh, right, right, right. So, I made a purchase the other day. I got it on sale because Christmas is over, so I wasn't able to put it on the tree this year. But, for next year... And... Now it's recording. Okay, for next year, I bought this festive Sonic and Tails ornament. Mark likes Tails. And Do you... I don't own anything where Tails is carrying Sonic. I have seen figures like that before, but they were in like a mystery box where you only have a chance of getting one. Oh, that would make J.J. Abrams happy. <laughs> but he'd never open it. But yeah, this thing is bigger than I thought it was going to be, so it's pretty cool. By the way, Mark, during the, uh, during the, um... Sonic Triple Trouble. Dur during the Sonic Triple Trouble L LP, you, you got Tails' theme song wrong. Every everyone knows that Tails' theme song goes, I want to get high. <laughs> it's like, Tails, Tails, are you high up there? <laughs> Smoking my weed with all of my bestest friends. <laughs> all right. So, um, you bored, you can just hang out over here. Okay, here we go. Mission start. And, and you might ask, what does that have to do with Devil May Cry? Well, uh, Virgil wears blue. It's a thing! And there's a thing over there! You gotta use the thing to oh, wipe. That, that's not turned off. I don't... I don't blame them for sending me a message. I sent them a message a few minutes ago. Oh. But I, don't, I don't think that's going to get recorded because that's not in the... Um... Okay, there we go. That is... Um, in, yeah, close that. Thank you. Because this is doing window capture and that's not coming up in the window. Anyway, do we really need to read this? You whack the thing to make the thing to shoot the thing. <sighs> All right. Do, 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 do. Oh, that's right. No, you have to. You have, you have to shoot the thing with your smord, and you whack it to. You shoot it to, to spin it, and you whack it to push it. Whoops! Did that way too late. <laughs> what was that? That was my phone not being on. Do not disturb mode. Donut. Disturbot. All right. Remember, you gotta you gotta spin it to make it go foida. But when it's not spunified, you you have more control. I practice this a lot. Here we go. You sound worried. Oh yeah. All right. Show yourself the only thing I give a shit about in the beginning of this fight. Not you. Not you. There you are! Fuck oh. you, asshole! Fucking cross, mother flunker. Alright, now let's see. Good to do! I bet you can to use my... Delay! Remember to use your delay melee. Oh, there's another frost behind uh -huh. you. Uh huh. There you are. Remember, you can click the right stick to uh, change targets. Right stick to change targets. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Wait, wait, wait. You can switch to these two. Okay. <laughs> Just by you doing that, wait, 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 you got your concentration up. Do it! Do it now! Oh! You know, you've learned how to do the judgment nut! Get over there, you fucking idiot! Yeah! I, I think you have a habit of having the wrong sword equipped. Fuck! Now, now you gotta shoot him with swords. Remember the move where you can... Oh, that, that, that did it. 
<laughs> this one! Thank you! Stick her into his face! You know, you can also throw the gyro blade into him to do damage, right? In fact, that's an option always open to you when they're around. Oh, he's going into his death roll. Okay, this is where I'm scared. I can't stop. Where is he going? Where is it? I can't. I, I, oh, yeah. Damn it. Uh, now, now he's just doing... Okay, now he's dying. Oh, gosh. That's the easiest time I've ever had against that fucker. Hmm. <laughs> You're having you're having one of my recording sessions then. Oh, practice was hell, and then you get to the actual thing, and you perform, and it's like what? Uh, that was nothing. <laughs> <laughs> or at least that's what people would think if you didn't have your commentary. <laughs> oh, coffin. Yeah, you gotta push the gyro. That that's already been that's already been um, struckified. I'm going to get lost a billion times here. You know, you just gotta jump down to where the blue coffin is. And you gotta push that into it. That's not relevant for this mission. You gotta whack it for the, the, the when you get off. And then you gotta... And try, try whacking it without shooting it. it. Wait, what a... I thought there were stairs there for a second. There are, st oh, there are stairs on the on the sides, but no stairs in, in the middle. Looks like there should be. Yeah, that's what threw me off. Speaking of you, and you gotta push that into the blue coffin. <laughs> the blue c the coffiny. Hmm. <laughs> Boom. You can't do anything with that now, but that will be relevant later. <sighs> okay. Get your Yamoto out and do the dashy slashy across. Or you could just do that. Combine Yamoto's dashy slashy with that and you. You get a massy wassy of destruction luxion. <laughs> Uh-huh. It's a thing. And another thing that's locked behind a thing. And these things. Oh, these things. <laughs> gyro blade. Gyro blade. Go to the right. I know exactly where to go completely off of memory. And I haven't played this since we did the uh, Lady and Trish mode. I've played this game too much on the PS4 is what <laughs> happened. Okay, go back. Come back a little bit. Go through the first door on your left. That one. You just passed it. And get ready to fight. I don't know if any of the enemies have been replaced. No, I can't do that. Thank you. By the way, that move, you, that ultimate attack you used against the uh, Blitz in that previous room, that's a screen clear move. Just thought I'd let you know about that. That will nuke everything on the screen. Whoa, damn, that was easy. Basically, you remember in Devil May Cry 3 at the end when um when you're fighting Virgil and he does the thing where like there's a bunch of judgment cuts all over the damn screen? Uh -huh. That that's basically what you're doing with that move. I I do like the way Judgment Cut looked in Devil May Cry 3 better. The the circular, you know vortex slash rather than the way it looks in this one reminds me of uh, the magic claw attack in Maple Story. Okay. 
There we go. And that was where the Aliu secret mission used to be, but you can't do that as Virgil because only Nero can do that one. Get ready to fight some more fuels. Oh, hello. Oh, it's the big guys. Yeah, can you lock onto it, please? Thank you. The way they replaced enemies in this one is one of the reasons I wanted to do Son of Sparta mode. And I thought Virgil would be the perfect opportunity to do that since he would start. You might want to. Oh, okay. It just fell behind you. <laughs> I was going to say, you might want to move. I've been watching a lot of, um video essays on video game animation lately uh -huh. and talking about how like the animation of a character can convey their personality just through the way they move and I think that's definitely something the likes of Devil May Cry and Bayonetta do very well I think Devil May Cry especially does it well with its multiple characters in that you def oh damn it! I teleported into it. You definitely get a sense of Virgil's, of Virgil, Dante, and Nero's personalities just through like their animations. Mm-hmm. <sighs> like especially the way, especially the way like Virgil walks. His walk animation has a bit of a swagger to it. Um, come, come back. Come back you, no, no, no. Back into the cage. You need that gyro blade to break the thing that, that other that's housing the other gyro blade at the end of the hall so that you can use both gyro blades to mini golf your way into the boss stage. Is that on the right or the left? Right. <laughs> Like I said, I know this. Uh, I know every area of this game practically by heart. <laughs> Did you think that you would escape from me? Because you're wrong. Nothing can escape from me. Not even me. <laughs> I mean, just ask Devil May Cry 3. Oh, uh, this is... fun. You... the... the... The camera flipped around? Ah! Did it again. Yeah, you still need that... You, you, weren't, you ran past it again, Mark. You keep mistaking it for a torch on the wall. There. Oh. The blue flame. You, no, 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 don't push it in yet. You need that to break the other thing at the end of the hall. Yeah. I swear, if you didn't tell me... The, the, the only way I know you practiced is your performance... I'm just losing the track of where I am in the stupid room. Well... And, and I lost track of where that this thing was, too, yeah. Yeah. I was, I was just going to say, if it weren't for your performance in combat, I almost wouldn't have known you practice. Yeah. Hey, you got to whack it again to wake it up. Because you can't have two active at the same time for some reason. And then this gets kind of tedious. And I think you push them past where they're supposed yeah. to go. No, wait, you didn't. Oh, I didn't. I didn't go far enough. Oh, 
Oh, that's right. The camera would the camera would flip out when you got it to where it's supposed to go. That, that's right. Yeah, wake up. Go. Wake up. Ugh. Ah. No. Well, that's how. That's how I figured out you didn't go far enough. Is the camera didn't flip bring... around on me. Not oh, this thing. Yes, I know. <laughs> not, not charge it. Go. <laughs> just like just get, get get in get in there. Almost. There you go. Oh. Not my favorite mission, unless. <laughs> What? The gyro blades aren't that but oh the blitz. <laughs> Why hello. Okay. It kinda missed. Okay, didn't miss that time. There he is. Yeah. Remember, his mouth is his weak spot. Or you can just keep doing this. But yeah, hitting him in his mouth does more damage. Go, go, go! Get, get, get! Oh, Holy shit, you took almost all this health. Yeah, like I said, this guy did not take me long at all on my practice run. Usually in Devil May Cry games, Virgil often has, like, the highest overall DPS. If you know how to use him. Ow! Oh, jeez! Crap! Devil Trigger will get you out of that, but you didn't have enough. Yeah. Devil Trigger in any Hitham C game will get you out of a grab. Ah, damn it! Again? That didn't even happen to me in my practice run. He just died. <laughs> I just died. He just died! Yeah, he, he... He goes away after... Stop doing that! They didn't even do that to me in my practice run! I think you got cocky. Ugh! Stop freezing me! Yeah, he'll come out, eat you, and then run away like a bitch. Let me... Let me attack! What the fuck? It's like, I, he just... I'm gonna put my sword away. Uh, it's because he does that after the attack you just did. He did not freeze me at all on my practice run. I just fucking killed him. Well, you got hit a few times, which... Hey, like, Virgil, how about you keep attacking instead of fucking around with your sword? Just keep attacking them! He's like, I'm gonna put my sword in. Okay, that time they just straight up did it with, like, no fucking... It's almost always the one that you're not fighting, generally speaking. It's usually the one that's behind you that tries to get you from... Tries to get you to side. Always be weary of the one you're not attacking. They're gonna be the ones that try. You wanna try to keep them as far apart from each other as possible, generally speaking. That's usually the tactic. And remember, the higher your uh, focus gauge is, the more damage you're gonna do. You also do more damage when you just hit him from the front. He's dead. Yeah, that was... That was ridiculous. That, that went nothing like my practice battle against him. Yeah, you're having one of my days. The thing that you dread the most, you, you get through no problem. The thing that you're like, oh, this will be easy, it kills you. Oh, where's that teeny? There's like a teeny. Yeah, it's right there. Itty 
bitty speck of a door on the map. I can barely see it. <laughs> Ooh, I got an A on my practice run. They'll do better against the boss next time. Anyway, how long is that? I don't know. I can't see anything when we record this game. <laughs> Uh, that was... About 20. 20 minutes. Yeah. That, that's okay enough for an episode, unless you want... Uh, I can't run the the next one. Again. Uh huh. Uh, uh, sure, I'll just make it an episode, I guess. We'll see you next time for more Virgil. Well, that didn't go exactly according to plan. It went better for the Blitz, but Bale, what the heck happened there? That was really weird. Anyway, if you like this content, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And if you want to talk to us, you can join our Discord server by clicking on the link in the description below. Later!